Live from the 21 News studios in downtown Youngstown, this is 21 News, 6 p.m. Good Saturday evening. Thank you for choosing 21 News. Corey has the evening off. Sunday Easter Mass at Warren's Blessed Sacrament Church will carry with it an extra special meaning for churchgoers. The parish is gathering for the first time since a December fire. 21's Connor Steffen caught up with its pastor ahead of what will be a very special reopening. Connor joins us now. Hi, Connor. Hey, Chris. Yeah, you know, Easter is a time of joy and hope, and this celebration of the Resurrection Sunday will undoubtedly be a milestone for the parish after four months of efforts to put it back together. At Warren's Blessed Sacrament Church. We had tragedy four months ago, and now we have the gift of rejoicing. The culmination of months of hardship following a tragic accident in December. The morning of December 12th, we were expecting just to come over here and have third Sunday of Advent. Instead, church officials were met with flames. A scene Blessed Sacrament's pastor, Father Cicero, won't forget. It just is shocking, it's surreal. And then to come over to see the, the state of the place, that this entire environment was filled with black smoke. You know, you couldn't breathe. Fire has its effects. It burned the ambo or the pulpit. That's the primary thing. Father Cicero says restoration efforts are now complete. From the installation of a new wooden platform on the floor all the way up 60 feet to the church's ceiling. And go up and wash everything by hand and then paint everything. It really took a lot of time. And now four months later, hundreds and thousands of dollars in renovations later, Blessed Sacrament will reopen for Sunday Easter Mass. The day of the resurrection is the perfect day to be coming back to you know, the fullness of our parish life. I think it was God's will that it would be Easter Sunday. The reopening will include a very special guest as well. Bishop Bonner will be here to celebrate. I think what I hope to encounter tomorrow is what those first followers of Jesus encountered at the empty tomb, that the stone was removed and there was good news and the long darkness was over. And for Blessed Sacrament, that Easter message of hope is one that will surely last long after April 17th. In the end, in the long run, we will see how God's hand was at work in moments of suffering, in moments of tragedy. With more local news, I'm Connor Steffen, 